Hi, my name is Darla Baker. I'm a novelist and podcaster at taliachase.com and therapy.cafe. I'm here today to participate in the I Bared My Chest Challenge. To raise awareness for the I Bared My Chest book and its global mission to raise $1 million for a list of charities who are empowering women and children around the world. The challenge is to state whether I'm bold, brave, or ballsy, and then I have to prove it. I'm going to prove that I'm bold. I'm going to reveal something about myself that I've not spoken about in over 30 years. I spent my late teens and early 20s fighting a losing battle against severe depression. On a particularly bad evening, sitting alone in my college dorm room, I threw a glass bottle of Pepsi against the cinder block wall and it shattered into a million pieces. As I was cleaning up the broken glass, I cut my finger and it started to bleed and it felt good. So I picked up a particularly well-suited piece of glass and I began cutting into the flesh of my inside left forearm. And I felt better. So much so that I continued to use this method of relief for about a year, hiding the cuts and scars from my friends and family and everyone else I encountered. And then one Wednesday night, standing in the parking lot of a hospital emergency room, I picked up a piece of glass off the pavement and I carved help into my arm. And then I walked through the emergency room doors. From there, I was checked into a private mental hospital where I spent the next 30 days. Aside from a couple of brief relapses, I never cut again. Over the years, I've considered plastic surgery to mask the scars. I'm not sure why I've never followed through with that. But recently, I've sort of reinvented myself. I left my 30-year career as an engineer in technology, and I became an indie author and publisher publishing my first book in June. What I didn't anticipate when I made that leap into writing was all the wonderful, amazing women I would meet in the lesbian community. They've taught me two very valuable lessons. First, too many women have suffered and continue to suffer from inequality and abuse. Second, tattoos on women are a beautiful, artistic, external expression of what's hidden inside them. So for 2017, I'm going to be bold and have my arm tattooed over my scars. Not because I want to hide them, but because I want to demonstrate and remind myself every day the girl who cut herself not only survived, but she thrives. And now I'm going to challenge three of my friends to take the I Bared My Chest Challenge. Just create and upload a short video revealing you're bold, brave, or ballsy, and proving it. And then tag three of your friends to do the same. Let's keep this going and reach the million dollar goal for women and children everywhere. I challenge Annette Mori, Nancy Healy, and Penny Collins. Feel your power and have fun with it.